Hello everyone, this is Gyanan Verma. Uh, today we are going to know about pandas. Basically in the Python language, pandas is a programming library that is used to create, manipulate and prepare analysis report using the this module. So now we are going to start with this one, how actually we can work with Python pandas. Here you just need to go for IDLE first as IDLE is the default editor or IDE of Python language. So it can be used to create any set of Python program here. If you are going to work with this particular in, uh, interface or IDLE, you have two basic interfaces. First one is that is called interactive mode. This mode is basically used to work directly like a MS-DOS. Here you can write your program directly like if you wanted to pre, uh, create a program hello world, you can directly write like this hello world and press enter key to execute. In same way, whenever you are whenever you are going to file and new then it will gives you a script this is the another interface of ideally using this interface you can create your own program and store it for the lifelong like i am just going to use print hello world and now we are going to save it file and then after save here i have to write the name and the location too now I'm going to save it to the desktop and give the name hello world dot py actually dot py is an extension of python language and we are going to write a first program in the python here after saving this particular file you can go for the run menu and click on run module it will execute the statement here so this is the another way to execute your program in the IDLE now I am going to close it. Here in the interactive mode, if you are going to write any pandas script, it will not going to work because in the default installation, Python is not uh, installed or basically it do not come with the default installer. So whenever you are needed to work with Python, pandas and related uh, library you must have to install it now i'm just going to take uh, a example to test is it have its own python pandas or not import pandas as pd here import is a keyword using it you can import any set of library of python language and pd is the object of pandas so whatever the uh, program you are going to write you have to follow the pd that is the object of the pandas library here it says that there is no library pandas available so now we are going to install it first and after that we can go with this one i'm just going to close it and open command prompt here is the command prompt available. You can go with this one with the help of the menu also. You just need to go for like this and type cmd and then go for run as administrator. <laughs> Before working with this particular um, Python library, you must have to change the directory first and switch to user account user folder cd users dir cd gyan4 cls dir cd here you can find app something like uh, option here that is app data now we are going to clean it and going for the another part 
that is cd local cls then again dir you can go for the cd space here you can find tamp vr a uh, common blue stick packages programs here you can go for programs cls dir here you can find python folder pythn python cls dir actually you are going to follow the folder one after other using the cd command you can directly move it with the help of my computer also but i am doing it systematically dir here you can see there is a folder python 310 so we have to move for it python 310 cls dir and after that you have to go for <coughs> the leap option cd actually script S -E -R -I -P -T -S, scripts cls dir here you are actually accessing the pip command using this particular prompt you can execute this pip command to install pandas so now i am going to use pip space install ins taal pandas actually whenever you are needed to install any module you have to go this way whenever you are working with command prompt or ms dos after clicking you have to wait for executing of this command here is the process is going on to install the pandas into your system it is a very simple process you just have to keep in mind that where actually your python is installed in this particular computer there is uh, there is a gyan4 is the username and uh, these are the folder that contain python like user is a first folder of c drive after that you have to go for the gyan that means the username and after that you have to achieve app data local programs python and follow accordingly you have to keep in mind that whenever you are working with this particular script or pandas you must have to follow the same on your own computer now i am going to exit from here uh, this actually shows that uh, there is a uh, some upgradation is needed so i just need to go for python dot exe minus m pip install double dash upgrade pip actually i am going to upgrade the existing pip command for the newer one so this is the process it is required whenever you are going to use a uh, latest python packages then you have to update your pip command and pip program now your system is executing this code and here you are you can say successfully installed now i'm just going to exit from here and open ideally here now i'm going to use import pandas as pd here you can see that there is no any error found whenever i am using this particular statement in the last time i was using the same but it gives a error so now this system is installed with the package pandas so i can directly work with any set of its sub libraries i'm just going to create a pd s is equal to pd dot series and after that i'm going to create a list here 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 comma 5 and 6 and finally this particular program is going to create a series for the pandas and now i am going to use it for like this way 
so it will list out all the numbers that is stored inside as a list with its index position you can see it okay now this is the final you have uh, uh, you are uh, going to understand how actually you can install pandas into your computer for uh, further i will continue this particular video in the upcoming video part thank you everyone